Oh, how quickly things can change. 0-8 against their arch rivals to start the series. It seemed the Bronx Bombers just could not beat Boston. But after three dramatic Ws, the Yanks enter Sunday sitting on a sweep, the likes of which just might send the Fenway faithful into a frantic freefall off the Charles River Bridge. The Yanks holding the Sox scoreless for 24 consecutive innings in the process, opening up a five and a half game lead in the AL East. This one a pitcher's duel early. Andy Pettit for New York takes care of Kevin Euclid and Jason Veritek. He's opposed by John Lester, who was equal to the task. Nick Swisher and Robinson Cano both down on strikes. We are scoreless through two. Your first hurler in trouble is Pettit. Two singles and a walk have the sacks packed in the fourth, but he'll get Jason Veritek to line out to left. Johnny Damon squeezes it. The scare avoided, we're still scoreless. Bottom six now, Lester. He will sit down, Damon, and also get Mark Teixeira. John Lester through six, just three hits, no runs, and seven Ks. Pettit, though, also relentless. Top seven, Mike Lowell to right. Look at Nick Swisher, a little ballerina gymnast routine. The Red Sox, 31 straight innings without a run. The last guy they want to see is this one. A-Rod, the hero in game two. Here we go again for the second time in three days. He breaks a 0-0 tie. One zip Yanks. The lead though short lived. Top eight, pet it out. Phil Coke in, Bmar gone. A two run homer. First run in 32 innings. More importantly, the Red Sox have a lead up 2 1. The Yanks though are unfazed. It's Damon going deep. Not off John Lester, off the bullpen. It's a game tying homer and it's 2 to 2. Your next batter, Mark Teixeira. And for the sixth time this season, Damon and Big Tax have gone back to back. That's a Yankee record. It's a 3 2 ball game from the Bronx. Three batters later, this is the play that will secure the sweep. Nick Swisher, a two-run single to score Jorge Posada and Alex Rodriguez. The Yanks go up 5-2 and they will bring on Mariano Rivera in the ninth. He gets Jacoby Ellsbury to ground out weekly to first. That'll do it. The first time since 1985, the Yanks sweep a four-game set from Boston in the Bronx. Both starters, Pettit, Lester, excellent, though neither figure in the decision. A-Rod, Damon, and Tex with homers. The Sox do finally score, but not nearly often enough to avoid falling six and a half back in the AL East.